faceoff is just seconds away. You can feel the intensity of this one. Total playoff atmosphere. We're underway. Into the attacking end. Takes the feed at the point. Takes the shot. And he's tripped up on the play. Referee's hand goes up here. Down the left wing and into the offensive zone. And the officials will pass the sentence here. McKay is called for tripping. He's off to the box. First chance of the night here on the man advantage. Scoreless game right now, James, but an opportunity on the power play. You have to find a way to convert. Move that puck quickly and open up lanes. Here's a pass in front. And that's stopped. Trying to get the puck out of his own end. Just moments away from the resumption of this power play. They're ready to drop the puck here for this faceoff. And momentum on their side as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. And he stopped that one. Sushko's got the puck along the wing. Fires it on there. They score! A shorthanded goal puts them in front. Well, the role of the PK is to go out there and stymie the power play. Instead, they go the other way. They recognize the opportunity, and they get a goal. Well, this is a really smart shot through traffic, James. The recognition of the net front presence in screen, and the goalie drops to the butterfly position, really tries to make himself as big as possible, hoping that the puck just hits him because he can't see it. The Snowflakes draw first blood here in period number one. Now, it's been a bit of a scrappy play going back and forth here, James, but they get up by one, and got to wonder if it now opens the game up. Chelabinks cross the line and on the attack. Quick pass to Kravstar. Huge stop by Hudobin. Covers it up and we'll get a stoppage in play. Down the right wing and into the offensive zone. Steps up with the block. From one point man to another. Oh, it goes right up the post. My goodness, they are really starting to dial up the pressure here now. Receives the pass. Chelabink's got the puck against the boards. Scores! And that's his first career playoff goal, and he'll take it. Uh, he will, James, because the playoffs is just a different beast. It's not regular season anymore. You want to be an impact player. You want to make a difference, and he does tonight. Well, he's in tight to the net, James, and he knows that he's not going to have much time or space to get it off, so he elects to use the snapshot and beats the goaltender. Second communication before both teams get ready to drop the puck here. Chelabink's got the win off that draw. Great defensive effort with the stick. And makes the save. Picked up along the boards by Murphy. Inside the final minute of the first here. Darrow Gucins has taken down to the ice. We got a penalty coming up. Let's get the call here. Listen, it's a tight game. It's late in the period. You've taken a penalty. Now you got to stay in the present, stay in the moment, kill it off, and then you can reset the intermission. Chelabink's power play unit puts their hard hats on as they go back to work. No, they haven't scored on the power play tonight, James, but you got to figure it's got to come, especially when they use what's given to them. Getting the puck up high to the quarterback. When that shot goes through, man, does it create havoc as everyone's looking for that rebound. Another face-off looming here on this power play. 
Noble Sieberts won the face off deep in their own end. Here's a chance to move the puck outside the zone. Oh, and they can't get it out as they are still stuck in their own end. here in the first. Well, it's all about quick strike. Now they've got the go-ahead, so they know that they can be confident with the puck, but they certainly can't sit back and protect it. Smart heads up, play to intercept the pass. No, no, Siba has been working hard all night. James is an intercepting pass at a great stick position, and it's been a defensive clinic. They've got to find ways to get to the other side of the puck and generate some offense. The second stanza is underway as the puck is dropped. Let's go. Across the line from center. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Cuts to the point. How did he stop that one? That's a great save, but the goaltender had to get out to the top of his crease, take away all the ice and make himself as big as possible. Let's see what the officials are calling. Well, with a one-goal lead, there's a small margin of error, James, and to protect it, you can't be in the box. Now they're short-handed, and they got to find a way to kill it off. Noble Siebert's man advantage unit will take to the ice for the first time tonight. Power plays are a funny thing, especially when you're down by one, James. You have to act as if you are the hunter, and you have to possess that puck and attack. Gains the zone from the right side. Good defensive stop with the poke check. Delayed penalty coming up here. Big stop by the goaltender right in front. There's the whistle, and here's the call. Well, this is a critical juncture of the game. You've got the one goal lead, and now you take a penalty. The PK unit has to be the task and kill this off. the advantage here with the power play and it's an opportunity for him to use his zone ability and maybe even help the team light the lamp. McKay has won the face off here in the offensive zone. Vakali's going to hang on for a whistle and staying focused is key when you haven't seen a lot of work here, Cheryl. Well, part of their mental preparation as a goaltender, even when you're not busy, you have to stay dialed in, follow the action. He's doing exactly that and makes a nice cover. And off the draw, they'll take possession. Great heads up play to poke it away in the offensive end. Oh, stick save and a few. Montreal's ready to take the draw here on this power play. And they win the draw on their own end. Battling for it along the boards. Quick feed to Beck. Dismiss that chance. I love this save, James. I mean, the goaltender is so aggressive on this play. Doesn't give the shooter any time to get rid of it. No, sir! Kukali has been dominating the... Oh, he's so good! What a stop! Well, that's desperation at its finest to be able to get to that puck and send a clear message to his team that he's behind him. Oh, good on the play! Wow! Well, that's a true competitor save. Just when you think that he's completely out of it, James, he comes across with a desperation save to keep his team alive. Impressive save. Love looking at this one again, James. You know that this goaltender is dialed in so focused when they're doing everything to get to the puck and keep their opponent at bay. More than half the period left to play. Chelebink's got a slim lead. They lead it 2-1. And they win the defensive zone faceoff. Well, when you're looking for a goal, being shorthanded is not ideal. 
both. You're also killing valuable time or you can be pressing when you're peaking. And they'll roll the power play unit right back out. Well, they've already scored tonight on the PP, James, and looking to really thread the needle again on this one. Their movement, their adjustments have been excellent thus far. Here's a chance to get it out. Goes right to the crease. Fantastic save. Tractor's got a hold of it along the wall. Here's a chance. Didn't get all of it, but just got enough of it with the trapper. They just keep coming in waves here in the offensive end. Offensive end now down the left. Here's a shot. There's the whistle. Let's get the call from the officials. This is a tough situation to be in. You're frustrated. You've taken your third penalty of the period. You got to kill it, reset, and find a way to push on. Well, things should open up for both sides here with a little four on four action. Four on four can be pretty confusing when it comes to coverage. You know that your defense have the forwards, but the forwards have to be able to contain the D as well. So it's complete defense out there. Novo Seabrook's had their opportunities, but they still trail late in this second period. Off the face off, they take the puck. Through the neutral zone and into the offensive end. Excellent stick work on the play. Forty minutes down, still another 20 to go here in this one. Join us for period number three, next. Teams are lined up and they are ready to get this third period underway. And they have dropped the puck here on the final frame. Two-thirds of the way to the finish line, and this one for regulation time. Cheryl, how do you view it? No, well, Seabrook said the puck a ton in this game, so it often is difficult to find yourself trailing in it. And you know that there's some frustration when it comes to that, but the coaching staff will be telling them, in particular, between the second and third intermission, to stick with the game plan, continue to be urgent, but be a little more aggressive around the net, and get net run on every shot. And that's blocked from someone in front. And that goes wide. Sometimes players get in That's a result right there, not hitting the net. And the defenders come up with the puck. Takes the pass. Chelepink's moving it into the offensive end. Scores! And look at that, the rookie gets in on the playoff scoring. Well, talk about embracing the nervous energy. Now he can take a breath, feel good about himself, and let the creativity flow. That's a hard shot. The goaltender looks like he's just getting to position, gets a piece of it, but it still goes in. Inching closer to the midway mark of the period, Chelepink's really controlled the pace of play these last few minutes, leading by two. Into the offensive zone, down the right wing. Quick shot! And that goes off a player. And does it again. Oh, man, he's so dialed in. Makes consecutive saves there and keeps his team in it. Looks like we got a penalty coming up here. Whistle stops the play. This is an easy and obvious call to make. I mean, the official's right there, James. What are you doing? You're going to extend your arms away from your body. You're going to sit for two minutes. The Snowflakes send their man advantage unit out once more. Well, they haven't scored on the power play yet, man. It is a tough thing to do, and this is an earned opportunity. They practice, they know what they're doing. It'll come. Great reach with the poke check. And that banks off a stick. Well, this is an uncharacteristic miss for him. I mean, he typically makes good on this shot and gives his team a boost in the arm. Not today, though. Goalie shuts the door. Puts it on goal. And another save. Chelepink's got the puck in the defensive end. And a huge opportunity is wasted by the power play unit here as both teams are back at even strength. 
Scores! It's in the back of the net, and it comes from an unlikely source because that's his first career playoff goal. Well, he's been relentless, James, in this playoffs, and you know what? He's found a way to find the back of the net. That's going to be a huge confidence boost for himself and his teammates. Noble Seabrook's goal has suddenly tightened the gap here in period number three. Well, they're within one, James, and it's not enough right now, so they're going to have to continue to counter, transition quickly, but most importantly, retrieve the puck. That is critical to be able to possess it. And there's a blocker stop by Hudobin. On the attack, they come down the right wing. What the stop. Referee's hand goes up in the air. We got a delayed penalty coming up here. Whistle blows, stopping the play. When you're down a goal, you can't generate any offense if you're short-handed. They're going to have to be opportunistic, find a way to kill it off, and then reset the momentum. Chelebink's got a huge opportunity on this power play. The power play has seen success tonight, and I like what they've been doing, James. Just reading the ice that they've been given. Nothing static, a lot of motion, and really reading where the place that you attack is. And that goes off someone in front and doesn't reach the net. Chelebink's got the puck against the half wall. Still a tight one here as we approach the final minute of the third. Oh, how did he stop that? What a save by Hudo. Special teams so important. Can they capitalize on this power play here with a face-off? Play resumes as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. The pressure's on the defensive side of the puck, but they win it clean, and they have an opportunity right away with a tired group that they're playing against. Scores! And with that, I believe that's his first career playoff goal. Chelebink's been the better team tonight, and after that empty netter, that should pretty much seal the win for them there. Well, I like the way they've played, and they had an urgency at the end of the game here, and they're rewarded with the empty netter. They should have this one in the bag. Moving into the attacking zone. Centering feed. And it carries off a twig in front of the net. Play whistle dead. Penalty coming up. Well, the penalty's inconsequential. They've been dominant all game, and just have a look at the scoreboard. This one's over. A critical face-off looms here. And the extra attacker is on the ice, James. So much pressure on the center to win this draw. The Snowflakes win that offensive zone face-off. And that's poked away. Final seconds of this one, and the home fans certainly appreciate that they got their money's worth tonight. was the response I think a lot of people were waiting to see from this squad tonight. They're still down here, Cheryl, but they're back in the fight. Well, they are back in the fight, and they're punching and kicking their way back in, aren't they? And listen, when you have a two-game deficit, it just wasn't as if they were playing their kind of game, and it's almost as if the nerves have settled in. It's kind of, listen, they've got nothing to lose here, so they're clawing their way in from behind, and this is a very dangerous spot if they can get back to equal. Well, what a night of hockey, and the intensity will only continue to ramp up with the next playoff game, and we will see you all then here at EA Sports.